this video, you'll learn how to use the Smart Search tool and search within the current selection and Smart Search tools. When you are analyzing data on a sheet, Smart Search is available in the selections bar. As you type your search query, ClickSense filters all the field values and displays the matching items. The search terms are always compared against the beginnings of the words in the database. The search results show the combinations of matches found in the ClickSense database. If there is more than one match to your search query, a suggestion list is displayed with matches ordered by relevance. When you select a result, you make an actual selection of the values, just like when you select values in the visualization. The selections bar shows the selected values. If you use more than one search term and separate them by spaces, they are interpreted as separate search terms. As you can see, the result shows all the items that contain one or both of the search words. The search terms are each given a color to make it easier to identify the matches. If you want two or more words to be interpreted as one search term, use quotation marks to link them together. If you have made a selection, you can search within that selection. Smart Search does this automatically. All you need to do is add search strings and perform a new search. If you search within a selection and your query does not produce a result for your search term, you can start a new search by clicking Start a new search only for the search term. If you search within a selection using multiple terms and your query does not produce a result for all of your search terms, you can view partial matches by clicking Show Partial Matches. If you search within a locked selection and your query does not produce a result, you will get the message Within your current selection, there are no matches for these search terms. If you unlock the selection and perform a new search, the result will become available. Now you can find the term in your search and select the option you want. And that concludes this video. Thanks for watching.